<clears throat> in this tutorial we are going to learn how to be able to record your zoom meetings or webinars without the permission from the host now before you'll be able to record a zoom webinars you, you need to get a permission from the host for example when i try to record it will, it will ask me please ask the host to give you permission to record and you don't want to ask the, the, the host but most of the time the host may not even mind you or you may not be that familiar with the host or you're just a, a guest and you, you wouldn't want people to know that you are even part of the meeting or whatever reason you have but i hope it's for a good reason all right so if you are in that situation i'm going to show you a very simple a very simple trick and it's for free but you have to note that it does not come with a zoom app so it is just a workaround i hope that in future zoom will be able to allow us to record meetings without the host permission but for now this is how you are going to do it i hope you enjoy the tutorial and so let's 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 move on so what you have to do is that you must download the obs software obs studio it's open broadcaster software it's for free and it's actually used for streaming but it can also be used to record zoom meetings all right and that's how i found out that you can use it to record zoom meetings and it's it's, it's very effective and easy so um just download it for your, your platform i'm using windows if you're using mac or linux you can download so we're going to download it and then install i've already downloaded it so uh, I, I mean like I'm going to install and I have already installed it but uh, for the sake of this tutorial uh, we are going to learn to just double click to install it um, you know just double click to install it just the normal process of installing the software um, I've already installed it and uh, so I, I will not waste I will not install it again but this is a normal way of installing a software on your, on your PC okay now after the installation you open double click to open it and then so this is this is your obs all right okay now that we have our obs running let's go and join the zoom meeting so what i have to do is to join the zoom meeting so i'm going to open the zoom on my desktop and then i have to join a meeting I have to join the meeting so my friend has sent me a zoom link all right so i'm going to click to join the meeting open zoom meetings all right so this is the meeting i have joined now uh let me turn on my, my video so this is the host and this is me now i cannot now, if I try to record on this PC, it is saying that please ask the host to give you permission to record. All right, ask the host to give you permission to record. I don't want to ask the host to give me permission because he might not do it. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to go, I'm going to go to OBS, and once you are in the scene, you, you, you go to the sources, click on this plus icon. And then select window capture. All right. Then you can give it any name, or can you, you can leave the default name. Then you, you you select Zoom meeting. All right. And okay. Now right click, go to transform, and fit to screen so that it will fit to the screen. And that is all. Realize that the zoom has been identified inside the OBS. So all you have to do is click on start recording. Start recording. And that is all. The all the zoom meeting will be recorded. Everything that happens inside the zoom meeting will be recorded. Everything will be recorded. The only thing that you don't have to do is that make sure you don't minimize the zoom. Right? Don't minimize the zoom. If you wish 
to do anything on your computer just open what you want to do and do it but don't click on this minimize button all right don't click on it when you click on the minimize it will pause the recording so you may not get the actions on the screen all right you may not get the actions on the screen so make sure you don't minimize the zoom make sure that it is always maximized then you can leave it there or you can work on your computer you can do whatever you want to do you can play your music and there again make sure that it is recording a desktop audio so that you'll be able to get the audio on your computer so you, you, you click on the range icon go to properties and make sure that speaker headphone this audio is selected all right so that you can be able to record um the the desktop audio if you if you turn off the desktop audio you will not get um you will not get the audio from the meeting and there again make sure that you 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 reduce um the mic if not the zoom is going to pick the obs is going to pick outside noises so that for, for example if you talk outside the obs is going to pick the noise in addition to the zoom audio so make sure that the mic or aux is off it's only the desktop audio so that it's only the noise from your computer from the zoom that will be recorded so take notes all right i turn off the audio on my on the host on my iphone i'm using my iphone as the host i turn it off so that you don't get this this feedback but you should be seeing this this this, this audio audio, audio, audio. Signal, signal, signal. All right, to show that the zoom is being recorded. I hope uh, I have made myself clear. So, if you want to find where your recordings are saved, you go to your document, this PC, um, the drive C, the users, your name, and then the videos. All right, so you see this is the video that has been recorded from Zoom. It comes as an mkv uh, mkv file already converted mkv file all right so if you want to locate where you can actually change the the recording location where the files will be kept in that case you go to settings go to output go to recording and you see this where mine is kept so you can actually change the location you can save it on your desktop so that recordings will automatically go to your desktop. You can generate file names with spaces. Okay, so whatever you want, you can you can actually do it. So so that is how you go about it.